Welcome to Emilac Online Tutorial. Uh, we're looking at uh, to show that uh, dy ds equals v du ds minus u dv ds all over v square. Now, and this is what we call the quotient rule in differentiation. All right, so how do we prove this? Okay, now we're going to use the first principle to do that. Now we are given that y equals u all over v. Okay, so to this point there, now what we all need to do is to implement an increase in the various uh, variable. So which implies that y plus change in y equals u plus change in u all over v plus change in v. All right. Okay. Let us make change in y the sort of relation you have change in y then equals uh, u plus change in u all over v plus change in v all minus what y take note as y moves to the left right hand side becomes what negative so at this point you have change in y equals u plus change in u all over v plus change in v minus now take note that our y is u over v so here you have u over v all right so at this point uh, let us have a common fraction that is just one and by doing that you can just uh, collect uh, lcm so you have say change in y equals to u plus change in u then all over v plus change in v minus u all over v or let's just, just do the uh butterfly method v multiplied through by the numerator here and v plus the v multiplied through by the numerator here and the denominator tends to multiply each other so here you have the y i'm sorry changing y equals uh, v into u plus changing u then minus u into v plus changing v all over v into v plus change in v okay so now at this point now let us now divide uh both sides by change in x all right oh uh, okay but before that let's do something let us open the bracket so here you have change in y equals uh, v u plus v changing changing u then minus u v then minus u changing v all over v square plus uh, v changing v and I look looking at this we can see we have a common term here that can subtract each other so vu we eliminate vu can also be uv so here we have that change in y equals v du i mean changing u then minus u changing v then all over v square then plus v changing v so we divide both side by changing x so here you have so here you have a v then minus u changing v over changing x all over v square plus v uh changing v all right so as changing x tends to zero uh, changing y over changing s equals the y over the x all right and uh, the v goes to zero all right and uh, changing u changing x tends to become uh, the u over the x and same time changing v over changing x cause the v over the x 
So definitely this uh, equation becomes dy over dx in cos of v du dx minus uh, u dv dx all over v equals to the power of 2 because here dv becomes 0 all right so this is the proof of the quotient rule all right if you love what i've just done can you subscribe to my youtube channel and sure you click on the notification button to be notified of all my videos thank you and god bless you